not me, us. Not me, us. And, and LA, can I, can I just, sister, just say this? That the senator understands that he cannot do this alone. He met with many groups this morning and he said these words that when I become president of the United States of America, I need millions and millions of people across this country who are willing to step up for a political revolution that is transformative. This is about transformation. And as Brother Frederick Douglass put it, sisters and brothers, power concedes nothing without a demand. It never has and it never will. We are demanding some stuff in this country. That is not okay for the ultra wealthy to have everything and we have nothing. That the working class people from all walks in this life in this country deserve to live a good life. You 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 deserve to live a good life. And what the system understands is that we have in Senator Sanders someone who tells the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. So help us God. He dared us to dream bigger dreams. That it is unconscionable in the wealthiest nation on the face of the earth that people don't have health care that provides for them to live a good life. He spoke that truth in 2016. But sisters, brother, he's been speaking that truth for a long time. We got the receipts. Go back 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, speaking the truth. He's a visionary. His lived experience. He has that heart-soul agreement that is necessary for transcendence. But we cannot do it without you. So, sisters and brothers, can you do something for a sister? All of you who have cell phones, if you have not signed up to be one in a million, I need you to go to BernieSanders.com right now to become one in a million. Because when there are millions and millions and millions and millions of us on the move, there is no power on the face of the earth greater than a conscious-minded people on the move. We need you. You got to commit to bringing some folks out to vote, California. Bring some people. Because we are going to finish what we started in 2016. <laughs> we going we to do that. And with these hands, if you have a hand, those of you who can raise your hands, even on behalf of people who might not be able to do it, I want you to vibe with a sister today. Lift your hands for yourself and somebody else. With these hands, we will have Medicare for all in this country. With these hands, we will have college for all and trade schools. With these hands, we will ensure that our children are able to live a better life than we are living right now. With these hands, we will take care of Mother Earth. With these hands, we will pass the ERA. Shout out, ladies. With these hands, we will deal with a criminal justice system that sees too many black and brown and Native American folks as criminals in this country. With these hands, we will move towards transcendence. And this mission is so high, sisters and brothers, we can't get over it. And this mission is so low, we can't get under it. And this mission is so wide, we cannot get around it. With these hands, with these hands, with these hands, we will elect the senator from Vermont. With these hands, we will elect the freedom fighter for justice. With these hands, we will elect a courageous champion who doesn't depend on polling.
willing to tell him how he should feel. With these hands, we will elect a president that has looked at Wall Street and said, enough is enough and you will not continue to treat people this way. With these hands, sisters and brothers, we will elect Senator Bernie Sanders, the next president of the United States of America, with these hands, with these hands, with these hands.